So after a long time, we have another Cricut 24 patch and you can see the patch notes on screen. This is for PlayStation 4, 5, Xbox One, Xbox Series XS and Steam. I'm assuming the update is out on Steam only as of now. So the console users might get it tonight or maybe the next day. And let's get straight into it. First update added and updated photogrammetry captured during the Indian 2024 season. As you all know, the big end uh, guys were in India or a couple of months ago to capture or recapture the faces of IPL, the licensed IPL players. So let's have a look at some of these updated faces. Rohit Sharma looks the same. We have just played Bumrah with a much needed overall from the previous one, but it's still not that perfect. But yeah, much better than the previous one. One thing I'm not a fan of is how they have made the beard. It looks like they have sketched one on top of another. Tilak Verma here with a slight change in hairstyle. Klassen looks a little bit slimmer. Ashwin once again not that impressive. Once, once again they have added these brown eyes to most of these players. Sanju Samson with another update here. So not sure why they have added brown eyes. It's very easy to change. Even we can do that if they allow us to change the eye color. So overall it looks like a hit or miss and some of them look good. Some of them Mitchell Stark definitely looked better previously. This is not that great. I almost got scared. And uh, it's a horrible one for Shea. So yeah, look at that. His face. I mean, uh, not sure. I think this must be a mistake. This is not how he looks. His face looks like something went over uh, his face, something heavy. So Shea's hair doesn't look good, but some of them look good. Some of them are uh, not that great. Uh, Russell looks pretty good. I think one of the better models here in this game. Andre Russell. So the next one is they have updated the uniforms for England. So you can definitely see here the limited overs jerseys with an update. Looks pretty good. Uh, they always do English and Australian jerseys and play as well. Now coming to PSL, they added PSL jerseys as you can see the teams here. So if you are not seeing the jerseys for PSL teams, what you have to do is press on option and delete the teams. Don't worry, it will not delete the teams. It will just restore the uh, factory version or the original version and you will get these jerseys as well. So. These are the PSL uniforms that they have added. A uh, much, much awaited update here by a lot of Pakistani fans because the game has been out for eight months. Uh, but finally, we have the PSL jerseys. And this is the final one. Now, the Indian T20 League fixture has been updated. Now, you can uh, play two semi finals, one preliminary final, and a final. So, they have tried to make it closer to the real IPL stuff where we have qualifiers but yeah it's not uh, really perfect because in IPL we have qualifier 1 and 2 playing then the winner of the 1 going to the final and the loser of the 1 playing the winner of the 2 and 3 so it's not really uh, you know uh, perfect but here it is this is a bit closer to the real one uh, the two semi-finals then the uh, winners play another preliminary final and then they go through the final and finally they've added Bangalore and Chennai as a dummy teams to the Indian T20 link. So now you can uh, download the Chennai Super Kings and RCB from community and they will be added to these uh, the Indian T20 league tab. So now you can start a tournament with all the 10 teams. So these are the updates. Unfortunately, no gameplay updates, which uh, I was looking forward to. Maybe uh, we'll get something soon, but the gameplay really needs some updates, especially the fielding and uh, uh, stuff like that. So hopefully we'll get it uh, soon. But for the fans of licenses and especially the PSL, IPL fans, uh, it's, it's a pretty decent update. So do let me know in the comment section about your thoughts here. And until the next time, it's goodbye from me. Take care. Have a nice one.